Dao Morrow, who plays Detective Gibson, is a clown. <laughs> and that's great because I'm sort of a clown myself. And <laughs> in the scenes where Gibson and Rhodes have to clown, it's perfect because before they call, they, before they call action, we've already started clowning. <laughs> so we, we already had an instant chemistry when we met. Um, my audition process actually consisted of me reading with him, reading the banter lines back and forth because that's so much of the movie um, that has to be there. And it was it, meeting him and, and getting to know him. It's definitely fun. Uh, he's a great guy. As I said, I already knew Onira from some other projects that I worked on um, behind the scenes and knowing her beforehand. I already knew her, already respected her. Um, I had worked with Rob Prago before, uh, who plays our captain, uh, Captain Parker. And I, I, when I met him, uh, I met him working on a feature about two years ago. And he's a really cool guy. Had nothing but respect for him and all of our conversations we had on the set. Um, and I knew Doris Morgado. I knew her from a project as well um, from a, a while back. And you know, once I looked up and I said, well, I have so many people that I know already on this project. I said, well, gee, <laughs> it's going to be pretty easy to get along with everybody. And it was. And that's great for the environment because when people get along, work can get done. You know, um, And we all have a mutual respect for each other, too, where we can also stop and say something, uh, give a positive criticism, not just, uh, you didn't do that line right and leave it alone. No, we wouldn't say that because that's just rude. But we would, uh, you know, we can talk to each other and have positive criticism and actually discuss a scene because at the end of the day, we're a team. Whether I'm, you know, technically I'm the lead in this, but it's, it's more like an ensemble in the essence that we can talk to each other and work together in a scene. You know, there's very few scenes in this film where it's one person. So there's that teamwork. You need to work together to keep the, the storyline going, to keep the, the mode of, of, of the scene going, um, you know, just to keep the camaraderie up. So it's, it's been definitely a pleasure working with all these fine actors here. It's been fun. Jay Noor is an interesting guy. Um, it was my first time ever meeting him, uh, working on this project. And like I said, I, I, you know, I, I called Onira and was like, hey, so what's this project? What's this thing you're talking about? They need a lead? What's going on? Yeah, we had a lead and the guy, he's not, he, 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 he had to back out. He had another project and we need somebody. So, okay. So I called up Jay and talking to him, I could tell he knew something. He knew something of what he wanted to do. Now, I had never heard of him, and I didn't, I didn't know whether this was his first project or not. So when I'm calling somebody that I haven't heard of, I'm trying to find out if they even understand what they're getting into. And he did. He understood what he was doing because he had been doing it for a while on this one project, you know, having talent sort of weave in and then have to fall out of the process. So um, by the time I got involved, pretty much every character was cast. And... I'm on the phone with Jay and he's like, well, yeah, you know, here's what's going on with my timeline and here's, here's what this character's about and I, I, need to, I, I need somebody and here's when I'm looking to shoot and all these things. And I said, okay, cool. And he sends me the script and I read it and I enjoyed it. I liked it. I said, okay, I, I like this script. And then I'm, I, I do a little research and I'm looking on MySpace and, and, and Lincoln and I, I see he's linked to a couple of friends of mine that are all involved in the production. And I said, okay. Well, if they trust him, I trust him. So I, uh, I called him back and said, yeah, man, I'm on board. Here's what I like about the script. Here's my ideas as an actor for the character. Um, and let's, you know, I definitely want to make these ideas that I have work with your overall vision. And I have to say, and I always say this, it's great to work with a director that understands their vision, their vision because there's a lot of directors that don't, unfortunately. Um, you know, at this level where no one really knows us yet, but we're working real hard and there is talent and there is technical knowledge. You have a lot of people with a technical knowledge, but no talent. And you have a lot of people with talent, but no technical knowledge. And then you have those people that have one or the other and are willing to really try and work hard and learn the other one and come together and become a whole, um, 
a whole product, if you will, because th we are in the business of selling stories. So um, it, was, it, it was very interesting talking to him. And as I talked to him more and more, and as we start to get on the set, I'm realizing, yeah, he really, he, he really has thought this stuff out. This is great. I'm glad I'm here. And it, it all solidified for me when I finally saw the trailer because I hadn't really seen anything. I had seen a couple of scenes, but they were out of context. And then I saw the trailer and I said, yep, this guy's got it together. So uh, I'm, I'm proud of Jay. I think he's done a great job on his first film. Um, I, it's, it's a daunting task because a lot of people really don't realize how much work goes into making a movie, whether it's a short or whether it's a feature. And this guy bit off a lot to make a feature. And I think he's done a really good job so far. So I'm pleased with him. I think he's, he's a great guy and he's, he's got some more films coming down the pike, I'm sure of it. He's got to.